The 2030 Sustainable Development Agenda makes clear there cannot be development without peace and security. And disarmament is integral to achieving peace and security. Weapons fuel the fires of conflict. They are a major driver of violent deaths and an underlying cause of instability. Weapons destroy lives and livelihoods. The number of conflict deaths more than tripled between 2008 and 2014 to 180,000. When explosive weapons are used in conflict, 90% of casualties are civilians. The 15,000 nuclear weapons in the world cast an existential shadow over humanity. The use of just one, whether intentionally or by accident, would have devastating human and environmental consequences. Chemical weapons continue to inflict inhuman suffering. Vicious terrorist groups are actively seeking all kinds of weapons of mass destruction. Disarmament, by eliminating or placing constraints on these weapons, removes the tools of violent conflict. In promoting transparency and building confidence, disarmament de-escalates conflict and reduces tensions between parties, creating the breathing space for development and progress. Disarmament is a core element of the rules-based international order that the UN stands for. It was a founding principle of the United Nations, and disarmament remains central to its mission today. The UN's disarmament priorities are simple. To facilitate the international community's efforts to eliminate weapons of mass destruction, and to help bring transparency and regulation to conventional weapons in accordance with the principles of the UN Charter. Secretary General Ban Ki-moon has said, the world is overarmed and peace is underfunded. An overarmed world is an unstable and insecure one. Disarmament is critical to creating a safer, more prosperous, more equitable, and more peaceful world.